Zechariah chapter 1. In mid-autumn of the second year of King Darius's reign, the Lord gave this message to the prophet Zechariah, son of Berechiah, and grandson of Edo. I, the Lord, was very angry with your ancestors. Therefore say to the people, This is what the Lord Almighty says, Return to me, and I will return to you, says the Lord Almighty. Do not be like your ancestors who would not listen when the earlier prophet said to them, This is what the Lord Almighty says, Turn from your evil ways and stop all your evil practices. Your ancestors and their prophets are now long dead, but all the things I said through my servants the prophets happened to your ancestors, just as I said they would. As a result, they repented and said, We have received what we deserve from the Lord Almighty. He has done what he said he would do. Then on February 15th of the second year of King Darius's reign, the Lord sent another message to the prophet Zechariah, son of Berechiah, and grandson of Edo. Zechariah said, In a vision during the night, I saw a man sitting on a red horse that was standing among some myrtle trees in a small valley. Behind him were red, brown, and white horses, each with its own rider. I asked the angel who was talking with me, My Lord, what are all those horses for? I will show you, the angel replied. So the man standing among the myrtle trees explained, They are the ones the Lord has sent out to patrol the earth. Then the other riders reported to the angel of the Lord, Who was standing among the myrtle trees? We have patrolled the earth, and the whole earth is at peace. Upon hearing this, the angel of the Lord prayed this prayer, O Lord Almighty, for seventy years now you have been angry with Jerusalem and the towns of Judah. How long will it be until you again show mercy to them? And the Lord spoke kind and comforting words to the angel who talked with me. Then the angel said to me, Shout this message for all to hear. This is what the Lord Almighty says. My love for Jerusalem and Mount Zion is passionate and strong, but I am very angry with the other nations that enjoy peace and security. I was only a little angry with my people, but the nations punished them far beyond my intentions. Therefore this is what the Lord says. I have returned to show mercy to Jerusalem. My temple will be rebuilt, says the Lord Almighty, and plans will be made for the reconstruction of Jerusalem. Say this also, this is what the Lord Almighty says. The towns of Israel will again overflow with prosperity, and the Lord will again comfort Zion and choose Jerusalem as his own. Then I looked up and saw four animal horns. What are these? I asked the angel who was talking with me. He replied, These horns represent the world powers that scattered Judah, Israel, and Jerusalem. Then the Lord showed me four blacksmiths. What are these men coming to do? I asked. The angel replied, the blacksmiths have come to terrify the four horns that scattered and humbled Judah. They will throw them down and destroy them.